Right now, I finally look my polished self. So the side of me that you see when I'm filming. You know, it's very hard for people to imagine or understand or even believe the degree of uh, incapacity that I have, that my chronic illness provides for me. But when you see a bit of the other parts of my day, the before and after, it's, it's a little more uh, visible, so to speak. This is how it starts every day. I feel like the living dead. It takes so much physical energy to move that I don't have. And my body just feels extremely fatigued as if it doesn't have power, as if like there's no battery or juice or something, right? So it's noon right now. I finally dragged, and I do mean dragged, this body out of bed to take out the little pooch. I don't know, she's somewhere back there, almost invisible. I'm gonna go shower, I come back, and you see the, the progression of my daily life. Now, a typical, uh, typical day, I do not get up this late. I managed to get up a bit earlier. <laughs> earlier, 10 a.m. <laughs> no, it, it, it varies. <sighs> but anyways, it's, it's disheartening. I just want to say that. I just want to say, honestly, you know, it's disheartening. Um, finding somewhere, I don't, you know, you, you have to find the strength that doesn't exist, both physical, emotional, psychological, to get up and do, because you gotta, I got it. I'm like every other human being. I have to do things in a day if I'm to survive. And it's just that every day is so darn hard. Sometimes I managed to shower. So even the finches are excited. They're, they're, they're applauding me. Um, cheep cheep to you too. <laughs> Hair dried, face on, clothes. <laughs> and it's only 2 p.m. That's it. But my, I'm, I'm less, um, I was going to say I'm suffering from less brain fog, meaning uh, words are able to come to me uh, easier because in the mornings, in addition to my body feeling um, heavy and uh, painful and swollen and all that jazz, so does my brain. My brain uh, doesn't fire quickly enough and I have gaps in, in uh, basic memory and as the day wears on I, I regain uh, a bit of my <laughs> mental sharpness, acuity, um, but then there are other days, probably like today, where I still feel the there's a lag between what I want to say and how long it takes for me to be able to say it. I'm always someone who pauses a lot when I speak, but there's a difference between um, my usual pause and ponder and this kind of a, a feeling where it actually yeah, it hurts in my brain. It hurts. Um, and it feels like cloudy and foggy and almost like you do when you're drowsy, when you're half awake and you can't put everything together quickly. The sun is out, of course. I feel sad that I'm not out there because it's taken me all day to get to this stage, so... <laughs> Lucy, what are you complaining about? Hmm? You want to be in the part of the discussion here? I think we can make that happen. You're so darn cute. All right, I shall. Bid you adieu. Yes, those are my little finches. And goodbye from Lucy and I for now.